Time to get up, buddy. Good morning, everybody. Today is June 10th, 2021. Uh, today is a Thursday, and it is also day two of the new company orientation. Um, yesterday, you saw a quick picture of the new truck. I like it. Um, but other than that, I don't know what today has in store. Um, I'm going to let you know, obviously. Um, but we just left the house. It's 7.36 a.m. And uh, should be there by 8, right on time. What's going on everybody? Day two is done. Um, I'm getting ready to eat some dinner here in just a little bit, but I wanted to show you this purchase that I got at Walmart for the truck. Um, because, well, I'm getting old and this is how you know when you're old. When you get excited for an Instant Pot. Oh yeah. Looking up some delicious treats on the truck. Um, no, but I'm just, I'm sick of eating out. I mean, you spend 20 to 40 bucks a day uh, eating out when you're on the road. So it's good to to have a have something to cook. Um, and I had a um, little one burner camp stove that I used to cook on, uh, and it just it just took too long. And the the it was like a it wasn't propane, it was butane. And uh, it, it just I don't know buying that. Keeping it ventilated, blah, blah, blah. I just decided to go ahead and get the Instant Pot just because you do a lot more. It's easier, it's safer, and it's a lot quicker. So, All right, guys. Dinner was good. Hawaiian Brothers, if you never had it, it is real nice. Um, day two, orientation. Uh, let's figure out what, what we did. I uh, got there about 8 o'clock. Um, before the heat of the day started, um, they decided that um, we're going to do like the deck building. So we built... They taught me how to put the top deck on the trailer, tear it down, lift it up, lower it. Uh, then we did some ramps um, to, to load up the, that side-by-side -side, uh, that you saw me driving around a little bit ago. Um, and then took down the ramps. Um, so that was it for the outside. Uh, that took us up to lunch. Uh, lunch, you saw Cubano, of course, Jimmy John's. Um, and then we just kind of did a little bit. Oh, I got forklift certified. No clue why, but I am now. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why they wanted me to do that, but um, they they just came in and they were like, oh, we got to take your forklift test. I'm like, say what? They didn't tell me I was going to have to be forklift certified, but I guess it's just something that if in like an extreme case, I'd have to run the forklift, whatever. It's very easy. Um, then my dispatcher came in spoke with her for a little bit um really cool super laid back she's, she seems like she's on the ball um i guess the way they do it which is awesome they they've got me a load out to north carolina but also they've already got my return load from north carolina back to kansas city so that's cool that's that's perfect um and then that's about it um nothing crazy i mean it was the, the, the outside stuff took up most of the time, but I mean, so far so good. Uh, I'm trying to think of anything else. Yeah, tomorrow, uh, tomorrow I think we're gonna do some ELD stuff. Um, and I'm taking off tomorrow. Tomorrow, that's, that's the plan anyway, so. Um, have another morning in the morning and get there, orientation, take off. So. Hope you guys are having a good evening, had a good day, and talk to you later.